everybody, welcome back. It's Alice, and I have a 99 cent store, 99 cent store haul for you guys. Um, I found a few good items. I wasn't really on the hunt for anything. Um, I did get a lot of things that I needed, but I did find a few new items, so I want to go ahead and show you those. And then I did get um, quite a bit of food, so I will go ahead and show you what I got. The first thing I want to show you are the new bath bombs that I found. I only grabbed these two scents. They had, I want to say like four different scents. They had the, this gold one, and then they had it in silver, and then they had a pink one, and then like a purple scent. I don't know what the scents were, but... I got this one. This one is the Bath Treasures Glam Bombs, and it just says Live Love Sparkle. This doesn't have a scent, but if you look closely, and I'm sorry, this is not doing any justice, but there's like gold speckles or gold glitter throughout the um, throughout these bath bombs. And then the other pack that I got by the Spa Naturals, and these are Ocean Breeze, and you get three in each pack. So these are the new bath bombs that I found. I did need a pack of facial tissues, so I got this 8-pack. You know that I like to grab the 8-packs. I don't like getting the 6-packs because what for? If you're going to already pay a dollar, you might as well get the bigger pack. But um, we're going back to school next week, and these are going to be perfect for backpacks and purses and things like that. Needed some new head and shoulders. This is the knockoff. This is the personal care eucalyptus dry scalp dander shampoo this is almost identical to the head and shoulders um, dry scalp shampoo so I did pick up two um, this one is the eucalyptus so it makes your hair feel like really fresh and clean I did pick up some more Epsom salts and I got the eucalyptus this is for sore muscles and back soak I got the eucalyptus I got the post workout I really like this one cooling citrus Epsom salt and I got the green tea and chamomile. The cam this one is new to me. I have not seen this one before in either Dollar Tree or 99 cent. This is the green tea and chamomile. So I did pick up one of each. And I love getting these. My husband uses them. My daughter uses them. They use them more than I do. But I still like to get them. Um, because they're good to have. They did have some foot scrub and some foot lotion. This is the tea tree oil. This is by Extra Care, and it's a 7-ounce um, bottle. And then I also got the lotion. This is a tea tree oil foot lotion, also 7-ounce. So that's going to be good. I did pick up a new water bottle for work. I go back to work the same day the kids go back to school. So I did pick that up. This one has a beautiful floral pattern, and it has this little pop top right here. And also this little finger ring, so I can attach a clip if I need to, or just hold it with my finger. I did find the Aroma Guru pumps. This is the ready to use Aroma Guru Relax. And this one is almond oil, sweet almond oil. Yeah, this one is sweet almond oil. So it's a, I believe it's a roller ball. No, this one's a spray. This is a spray. And then this one is in the scent. Oh, wait a minute. This is Sweet Almond Oil and is Relaxed Essential Oil. That's what this one is. And then this one is the Sweet Almond Oil and Lavender. Oh my gosh, it only says it right here. So I got the Relax and I got the Lavender. So I'm going to give those a try and see how they work out. My oldest daughter was with me, so she picked up a few essentials that she needed. She picked up this Coconut Oil, Via Natural Ultra Care Coconut Oil. And it's 1.5 fluid ounces. She also picked up the Vitamin E. I've always seen these, but I've never picked them up. I'll see how she likes them. If they were good for her, then maybe I'll pick some up. And she also picked up some hair ties. She goes back to college next week as well. I didn't mean to buy this. I meant to put it back, but it wound up in my basket and I wound up paying for it. This is a macaroon nail clipper. It's still really cute, but it's not. I really didn't want to buy it. I just thought it was cute, but oh well. And I did pick this up. This is an 18 inch lanyard and this is a mermaid pattern. It does come with a little mermaid, a little mermaid right here. And then it has this attached so you can put something to it. 
And then my daughter's best friend who moved away last year was her birthday and she's obsessed with sugar skulls. So we picked up this for her. We thought we could mail it to her and she would you know, it'd be a nice surprise for her. And also these wall stickers. So we're going to mail that off to her for her belated birthday gift. I also picked up this little container. I thought it'd be good for like soup or something leftovers. I can warm it up in the microwave at work and it has a little steam thing where you open it and let the steam out. Um, I just thought it was really cute. I really like the color. And that's it right there. And then one more non-food item for $4.99. I did pick up this really cool 48-piece food storage container. It can, includes one container, so this giant container, 12 of the 2.7 fluid ounce containers, 4 of the 12 ounce containers, 4 of the 16 ounce, and 3 of the 16.9. And it also includes all the tops. So I have been needing to get new Tupperware because, like I said, back to school, back to work, and all my Tupperware is just gone. So this is going to be great. And then I can repurpose this big giant one for something else. Um, now moving on to the food, I'm just going to get all this stuff out of the way real quick so I have some space. Okay, I forgot to show you guys this. This is a huge round beach towel that I got. And the purpose that I got this for wasn't for necessarily the beach, but my kids love to sit outside on the grass and they're always taking big old blankets out there and then I have to bring them in and wash them and they're just so heavy and huge. I found this there. It's kind of thin, but it's still nice enough where the kids can sit on the grass. And it was $3.99. $3.99 for this round beach towel. It's a, it's a 59 inches in circumference. And it has this beautiful um, beachy theme on it. It just has like beach shells and seashells and starfish and all these beautiful colors. So I wanted to show you guys that. I thought that was really fun. So they have something to use outside on the grass that's not going to be super huge. And they don't have to worry about taking a pillow, I mean a pillow, a blanket. And I got like this huge mess on my son's bed, so please excuse <laughs> the mess. And I also forgot to show you guys this. My son bought a new water bottle. This one has a nice big handle on it. It has this top up here so I can take it off and put ice in it for him. And then he has the pop top so he can use that for school. Alright, moving on to the food I did pick up these sandwich slices. Now I got I got the sandwich slices because I'm always cutting my pickles anyways for sandwiches. So I just decided to get one of the sandwich slices and then one of the regular pickles. Because we love pickles in this house. We really, really love pickles. I got a bunch of aloe waters. I got four of each flavor. So I got four of the coconut, four of the pomegranate, four of the watermelon and four of the pineapple and I also got and they only had one of the green tea so I got those we love our aloe waters in this house even my little guy all my kids my husband we all love aloe water so whenever I see them at the dollar or the 99 cent store I pick them up they do have them at grocery outlet they are a little bit more pricier unless they come in like a case then they might be a little bit cheaper but normally I get them at the 99 cent store Back to school snacks, I got this six pack of treetop applesauce cinnamon. Ranch is an essential staple in this house, so I picked up two ranch. I'm not picky with my ranch, I just need ranch in this house. We use it for a lot of different things. So I picked up two, and that's the light ranch. I also picked up four of these. My husband got two, my daughter got two. These are watermelon lime energy drinks they love these and they are they're low calorie and they are sugar free so my husband and my daughter got those we were out of crystal sauce and lo and behold they have it at the 99 cent store so that is also a must in this house for eggs and things like that i picked this up for myself because i'm the only one who likes really any kind of licorice in the house but this will be just a little snack that i keep in my in my um craft room I have in my drawer I keep my my secret stash is what I call it and I'm so bad at remembering uh, remembering anything that I have this secret stash full of candy and I always forget where I have my secret stash and 
And then I forget that I have candy in there. So I'll go in there and open my drawer and pull something out. And I'll be like, oh my god, there's tons of candy in here. So that's a nice little surprise for myself. Because I have very bad memories. Like short term memory loss. I don't know. But uh, this is going to go in that drawer. Hopefully I don't eat it in one serving. And I forget that it's there. So it lasts me. Another essential in this house is barbecue sauce. I'm not picky with my barbecue sauce. We just need it. I don't know who threw this in the basket. It had to be one of my kids. Because I know my husband wouldn't eat this. I think it was my oldest daughter. We usually get these when we go to Disneyland. Um, we'll get them and take them with us. Because the ones in the park are really expensive. But um, this is a garlic flavor. And that's also a good tip. You know you can take food into Disneyland. So if you're going to buy pickles... Get these from the 99 cent store, put them in your ice chest, and then the day that you go to the park, take them with you instead of having to buy those $5 pickles. They're really expensive. <sighs> I thought this was interesting. Pineapple topping. We eat a lot of ice cream in this house. And this looks delicious with some vanilla ice cream. Yeah, I'm going to try this. I picked up some chicken seasoning. We do eat a lot of chicken. Mazapan is... One of our favorites, dulce de cacahuate. It's basically peanut butter candy. It's made by De La Rosa. This is a Mexican candy. This is an essential in our whole, in our house. This is something we all grew up with since we were young, my husband and I, and our families. Um, we are Hispanic, so this is like a Hispanic essential candy in our home. And we always just like, we always try to open the package and whoever can, you know, open the package without breaking it. It's just like, it's so amazing. But, um... Sometimes I can find the big box, the 16-pack at the grocery outlet for $1.99, which is amazing because these things are expensive. But I found a six-pack at the $0.99, cent, so that's not too bad. Um, yeah, so that's eh, essential candy in this house. Picked up some more of the apples and strawberry. I got a two-pack, so I got eight for $2. Usually they had the six-pack, but they got smart and cut it down to four-pack, so... That's okay. We still like them. Also, we love eating manzanilla olives. This is just something that we like to eat as a snack with like a sandwich or something. Pick these up for my husband as a as a little treat, as bedside treat. He loves those. They're not the name brand, but they are good. Just as good. My daughter picked these up because she knew I really like these guacamole chips. They usually sell the big bags um, at the grocery stores. But this is a good size snack bag with... You know, I'm not going to finish all finish it all in one serving. You get five ounces in this. And then also for myself, since I'm going back to work as well, I thought these would be good to put in my lunch bag. You get six of the Country Time Pink Lemonade, and I really, really love these. I don't know why I didn't buy a two-pack, but I just got one for now. I do have a little bit more food to show you, so I'm going to get all of this out of the way and show you the rest of my goodies. All right, so the last of the food that I picked up was a box of pop tarts in the cherry flavor peter picked these out you get six in here and he also picked out the brown sugar we're going to be saving these for back to school on those mornings where we're in a hurry and we don't make it to breakfast they got that peter picked these up these are corn nuts nacho flavor that's his little snack my husband and i love these albanese um gummy blossoms and I can only find them at the 99 cent store I, I have seen them at other stores but they are like a dollar fifty a dollar ninety nine and I'm like oh I'd rather wait till I get to the 99 seriously like I would save 50 cents I picked up some oh my daughter picked these up man it's hard grocery shopping or shopping for your house when your kids are with you because they're just throwing all kinds of stuff in the basket and then you get so off like budget and off task and I spent more money than I was supposed to because my kids were with me but whatever these are the pica slice this is also Mexican candy they're watermelon candies with um chili over them these are really good we love those I picked these up for Peter's birthday these are the revolcados mix it's just a mix of different candies so you got elotes revolcaditas Mangos, pica slice, tamaros. So if you're not Mexican, then you're not going to know what I'm saying. Basically, lollipops and hard-filled candies with chili assorted flavors. That's what you're getting. You know, us Mexicans, we like our chili and we like our chili on our candy. This was a good, a good-sized bag. You get 
18 ounce bag for $1.99. So this is going to be good to split up for the goodie bags. And I also picked up more of the fun dips. I got three of the fun dips. Those are going to be going in the goodie bags as well. I'm not on top of it like I was with Lisette's. Lisette's, for some reason, was a little bit easier to plan because when I saw pineapple stuff, I just started picking it up little by little. But with Peter's, I was so focused on Lisette's party that I just didn't start planning for Peter's right away. And his party's in two weeks. And I don't have a lot of stuff for his goodie bags, so I need to get on it. I need to hustle and get to Party City or do what I need to do to find some Star Wars stuff, you guys. Jiffy. These were 79 cents. Jiffy blueberry muffins. I'm going to make these and freeze them ahead of time, put them in Ziplocs, and pop them in the freezer. And they can nuke them for breakfast on the go. Also picked up this four-pack brownie um, candy top brownies. The kids love these. Just a quick little sugary snack. Got to have our sugar. I love this slim tea. This is a lemon-flavored tea in green tea by Chami. Health, healthiest sip of nature it says this tea is really good it's supposed to be like help you lose weight but I just really like it and you get 20 tea bags and it tastes really 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 good another bottle of bacon bits these are imitation of course but I picked up another pack of the Weilers peach iced tea I'm going to be saving these for work I love these you get eight packs in there and then I picked up some fruit they had a lot of really good produce and I'm not going to show you the produce because I already put it all in the refrigerator I already washed it all and put it all away but I did get a huge bag of green grapes a huge bag of purple grapes a huge bag of cherries that were $1.99 and they were so 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 good cherries for $1.99 you cannot find good cherries for $1.99 anywhere unless you're at like a fruit stand I got two bags of kiwis these were 99 cents. I got a bag of nectarines that were so juicy and so good for $1.99. And I got, what else am I missing? I got two packs of strawberries that were 99 cents each and they were fresh and super good. And I got, I'm thinking that's it. I think that's all the produce that I got. So the grapes, the grapes, the cherries. Oh, I got two packages of blueberries for $1.99 each and they were amazingly fresh and good but I will post a picture or post pictures at the end of this video of the fruit that I did purchase I took a picture of it and then I washed it and put it all away um but I will put that at the end of the video so you guys can see the fresh produce you guys if you haven't gone to 99 for produce you need to check it out because they have a lot of really good stuff that was all the fruit that I did pick up and then like I said the two packs of the kiwis um this one was in this bag so I didn't get to put it away yet but they're still fresh um we love fruit in this house and my kids will attack that and that fruit all of that fruit this household of six people that fruit will be gone in about two more days I give it two more days tops but anyways you guys that is it for my 99 cent store haul. I hope you enjoyed this. Sorry for my mess in the background. It's It's been hectic around this house. We're trying to get our house ready and kids ready for back to school. Trying to deep clean, trying to declutter, trying to you know run errands and do last minute stuff, go to the Goodwill and things like that. Um, school shopping. I got school supplies everywhere. We got new school clothes everywhere. So it's this house is chaotic right now. So excuse my mess in the background. I do apologize, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. They have a lot of really good snacks right now, probably more than I should have bought. But what can you do when you got four kids shopping with you and a husband who likes to throw snacks in your cart? And then when you're at the register, you're like, whose is this stuff? And it's kind of too late because you've already purchased it and you don't want to tell the cashier. Go ahead and take that off because then you're the one at the register that everybody's staring at, right? We don't want to do that. So don't take your kids shopping with you when you're on budget. <laughs> You guys have a beautiful, blessed day. I will see you on my next video. And thanks for sticking around with me. I love you guys. And I will see you on the next video. Bye, everybody.